Hi, boys and girls. Today we are going to continue with day 29 talking about our opinions. We have been talking our opinions last week, and today we are going to be forming an opinion on where trees are planted, and we're going to be writing about it. So let's get started. Let's talk about what an opinion is. What is an opinion? What does that mean? Yes, an opinion expresses what you think or feel about something. Good job, you remembered. You also have to remember that it's very important to ask yourself, why do I feel this way? Why do I think that? So you can explain your opinion when someone asks you about it. Now we're going to take some time and take a look at this picture. We're going to be talking about our opinion today. Do you think that this is a good place to plant a tree? Do you remember last week we looked at a picture and you got to think about whether you thought it was a good place to plant a tree or not? Well, we are doing the same thing today with this picture right here. So go ahead, pause the video if you need to look at it for a long time and really look at this picture. I see trees and it looks like they're inside a building. So you have to ask yourself, do you think this is a good place to plant a tree? Think to yourself for a minute. You can talk to a friend or family member if you want to and say, do you think this is a good place to plant a tree or a bad place to plant a tree? Why do you think that? Now that you're thinking about your opinion, let's get ready to write your opinion. You should have this page in your packet. If you don't have a packet, that's okay. You can just get a piece of paper. Now that you have your paper and a pencil, now you get to think about, is this a good place to plant trees? I put a sentence up here to help you write on your own if you think this is a good place to plant a tree or a bad place to plant a tree. That sentence says, this is a blank place to plant a tree. So you decide, is it a good place or a bad place? What do you think? Then our next sentence says, write a sentence to support your opinion. This is when you explain why you think it's a good or a bad place. So our sentence says, it is a blank place because <gasps> all that space. You have to decide why you think it is a good place or a bad place. It's your turn to think about your opinion. You can use these sentences to help you write and explain what your opinion is and why you think that way. Remember, when you're done writing, make sure you send it to your teacher because I know they'll be excited to see you and how you've been writing your opinions. Good job today, friends, and happy writing!